good morning. I'll tell you, this one is called Shining Lights. Let your light shine before men that they may glorify your Father in heaven. I'm naming it Shame on Me or Proclaim Thee. Shame on me or proclaim me. It's really short and sweet, but that's how I like it, right? Okay. Our influence on society depends on our likeness to Jesus Christ. We cannot elevate others to a higher level than we have gone. Whoa. Whoa. <clears throat> we cannot elevate others higher than ourselves have gone. Marinate, soak on that. Marinate, saturate, let it penetrate your heart. All right. The first century Christians um, out thought, out lived, out loved their neighbors by their example. Pure purity and compassion attracted countless of thousands of Christians of faith. You get where I'm going? What do others see in your life that would attract them to Christ? Would they attract or detract? Shame on me or proclaiming thee? That is the question. So hope for today. Short and sweet, I lay it at your feet. And it can't be beat. <laughs> I'm a poet and I don't know it. Many will shy away from a light that, that exposes their guilt. Teach me, Lord, to shine your light in the way that highlights the grace of God and takes away the personal shame. I uh, don't need to say the name, but there's a brother who, um, one of the group has had contracted um, COVID and was in the hospital. They couldn't do anything for him. And um, I think he was just there a little bit, but um, just pray for this person. God knows this person. Very special to me. Uh, very special uh, man of God. So, Pray for him, okay? All right, all right. Love and appreciate all of you. And I know you're gonna proclaim and let that light. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Armor up to stand up, to show up and to speak up. Bye.